so hello folks a very good morning to all and i hope you are definitely watch the video till the end so in this video we'll be uh, dealing and we'll be studying about the current affairs or uh, we can say that india australia five years deal it might be uh, a coming or uh, in your uh, in your current affairs to current affairs to and what are the different portion of trade service and what are the different portion of good service which is usually been <coughs> agreed by the uh, both the pms for its bilateral relationship so let me uh, start the begin let me start uh, the ties with the uh, canberra as well as new delhi and it also become a tension for belgium so how we will be uh, dealing with these things how we will be studying all the things all the stuffs which are even prior important when we usually discuss about the relationship between india and australia so let me have a clear understanding regarding that and then after i'll be dealing with different points and different topics which i have already studied about that so the economic relation or economic cooperation and trade agreement which has been signed by australia australia as well as india what are the different components which usually they have agreed for one is labor uh, for intensive Indian uh, sector such as textile, gems, jewelry, <coughs> leather, food, farm products, and automobiles to benefit. That is one trade relationship between these two countries. Then after Australian coal mines or uh, minerals, oats, and wines to get easier entry for India to India. You can also even say that. So. Then after we'll be dealing with the. Uh, working groups to explore market assess issues to both sides in whisking and other alcohol beverages okay these are the goods and services which have become a impact in the which which usually becomes uh, which usually becomes uh, an impact we can even say to in, in the both the countries which is australia as well as india so then after what are the different trading relationship or you can say the trade in service so what are the service which we will be providing and they will be providing one is indian student in australia will get work visas okay <coughs> for two to four years okay they will be getting the working visas uh, for indian students okay then after australia firms in communication business construction engineering service to gain okay so that's the reason why Pius will has already uh, expected 10 lakhs additional jobs okay they have already created Pius Goel which is the industry minister or okay, so the commerce and industry minister have already signified that india will be getting uh 10 lakhs additional jobs okay so because of engineering service to gain as well as to communication construction civil engineering so those are first uh placing a very vital role then after fast track approval for uh patent or generic and biosimilar medicine so medicines also been a very good uh, communication between uh, regarding that uh, double impact or double bilateral relationship okay between these two countries so uh, this is how the bilateral relationship is all about and the and we can say that the agreement uh, seeks to encourage trade between what trade between two countries the agreement will benefit labor intensive sector apart for increasing quotas okay for indian chefs yoga teachers in australia so yoga yoga is also been placed a very vital role in that so then after it has been uh, also agreed that india will be in turn offer uh, preferential assist to australian to over 70 percent of its traffic line of the goods import including line of export interest to australia which australia which are uh, primary raw material and uh, uh, intermediate such as coal mineral or wines wines etc the commerce minister have said so Pius Gilip had said so then after it is also a very important point India exports to Australia has been growing at a rapid clip and the agreement which may expand further and its implementation in the current form will facilitate zero duty free assist so it is also important that zero duty assist so zero duty and over 96 percent of Indian export including several labor intensive okay so zero duty assist so duty assist custom duties are uh, maybe uh decreased or we can say the protection may be decreased we can even say that so then after how it usually placing a vital role with that with the chinas so we can say that with Beijing. so then it is a trade and economic partnership deal with australia which is a middle of the trail battle with china so it is a significant milestone at the time of development world and looking to hedge its supply chain independence so this is how uh, the relation has been maintained reciprocally with uh, both the countries and we can say that it becomes a tension for Beijing 
looking for the retraining relationship and how uh, there is there, there will be a sharp decrease in the in the in the, in the in the dependency of that country where we are in okay so this is how the india australia deals which usually six okay so which usually six to double bilateral trade in five years okay so i hope you have got an idea regarding that and the indian india australia and the significant tie between the delhi as well as canibera's tension okay so let me end the video itself thank you for watching my video thanks a lot